Beginning tomorrow, it's once again legal to light fireworks in Utah, but not everywhere. Yes, though. yes. Remember that many restrictions now in place because of wildfire risk. Also, Utah's extreme drought. And even if you can light fireworks where you live, it doesn't mean you should. It's really important to keep safety, of course, top of mind. Somehow that uh, escapes some Utahns, and we're joined here by uh, Governor Spencer Cox. Thanks so much for coming and talking to us about firework safety. It seems like a given that every year we have people who just aren't using the old noggin. Well, we're hoping that this, this celebration will be different, and that's why we're asking people to be much more careful with their firework usage. And in fact, we, we've decided as a family we're not going to light any fireworks mm -hmm. this year. We're going to see the professional shows. They're amazing. We just don't want to take any chances. It's so hot right now, so dry right now. We've had some monsoonal moisture, but uh, the chance of fire is very, very high, and we want people to have a happy 24th of July. Exactly. Nothing like ruining a celebration with a fire or an injury. You know, Governor a lot of cities had restrictions in place for the 4th of July weekend and since that they've expanded restrictions. What sort of recommendations were you providing cities, if any? Yeah, so what we're asking people to do is to check your location. If you if you really feel like you have to have fireworks, check your location, make sure they're, they're legal. There are many places in many cities where they're not. Um, they are illegal on any state or federal land right now. Any of our, our national parks, state parks, illegal anywhere. Most counties, they're illegal as well outside of, uh, of the city limits so please check and make sure and then again if you're going to do it be extra cautious make sure you have water near uh, water resources right next to you make sure you're not lighting them off anywhere near dry brush or, or trees um, even if it looks green um, it, it can be dry and it can go up in flames very quickly sure. you know in recent years I guess recent uh, from my perspective anyway we the, the legislature legalized aerial fireworks a at the time I kind of scratched my head and thinking we live in a desert for heaven's sakes once they go shooting up into the air you don't have any control over them anymore and, and that's why we 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 want people to go to the professional fireworks shows those are put on usually by the fire department themselves they have resources around to make sure that nothing happens once the wind's blowing and you light that that firework or it tips over mm -hmm. and and sprays into the yard or field yeah, next yeah. to you you have a real problem on your hands and and we will hold people liable if you start uh, even if it's an accident if you start a fire, you will be liable for the cost of putting out that fire. If you burn down your neighbor's house, it, it, it's just bad news. So we, we can't emphasize enough how cautious we need people to be. It's such a risk when you decide to light off fireworks. You know, I feel like my money is going up in flames enough lately these days. <laughs> <laughs> fireworks, they're a huge expense. And there are plenty of free shows around the entire state this weekend that people can go yeah, and enjoy. All over the place. Look, we've had about 600 fires this year. It's actually down the last two years. So Utahns are are listening. Good. They're doing a much better job. We we believe that we reduced fire 500 fires last year because of people just being smarter about it. We're hoping to do even more this year. Um, the, the the fire you you don't start is 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 the best of all. So so yes. just please please be cautious. Yep. All right. What are you going to do for Pioneer Day? You know, I'm doing the parade here okay. in Salt Lake. I'm doing the rodeo tomorrow night, days of 47. There you go. And then I'll go down to Fairview, um, big fireworks show in Fairview, demolition derby. It's the biggest day of the year in Fairview. It's bigger than Christmas. Oh, that it's sounds great. It's my favorite time of year. Oh, enjoy Barbecue it. at the Cox Farm. Absolutely. Come on down. All right. Everybody. <laughs> here we go. You heard it here, right here. Stampy turkey. You and your family try and stay cool. We will. You along too. Along with all the other Utahns. It's going to be a tough one. Thanks, Governor. Nice Thank to you. see you. Happy Pioneer Day.